Okay, there you go. Thank you so much for understanding. Miss Spencer. Uh, uh, please, call me Carly, right? So how's it going back there? Don't quit. Please don't quit. Katrina and I are making it work. Okay. I just came out to keep the barbarians at bay. Right, we'll keep up the good work. Are you sure that I can't help with anything? No, no, I want you focusing on studying. Study for that pre-final, please. Okay, Katrina's great, but is she qualified to take over for the cook? Yeah, yeah, she knows her way around a kitchen. I just wish the stove was working. There's no stove? Mm, and I keep trying to call the usual repairman and he is on an emergency. Okay, this is an emergency. I have a jack of all trades. At least I used to. How are you with everything? With the breakup? That? I mean, losing Spencer, Trina moving out? I'm fine, I'm fine. I, I appreciate you asking, but you have more important things to worry about. Okay, I hate when you do that. There's nothing more important than you. Okay, more urgent then. I will be fine. Your customers, not so much. <laughs> oh, help has arrived. Where? Thank you for getting here so fast. Yeah. Please tell me you brought the help. I am the help. We're doomed. Just Thank mm. you for the vote of confidence. Your brother is a capable young man. Yes, he's capable of picking up his platinum card. I just <laughs> don't know about a wrench. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go back to the office where I'm uh, appreciated. And then mom can call her new boyfriend to help. Has mom told you about the new man in your life? Who's this mystery man? Some FBI agent. Oh my God! How serious is that? I'd say it's pretty serious. I mean, I have a good authority that they're already graduated to uh, sleepovers okay. at the Metro. Oh, Port. Hey, that is enough. On whose good authority did you hear this, Nina? Oh, well, I should have guessed. This is just like that time where uh, Willow and TJ were having that torrid affair. Exactly. So, are you going to go in the kitchen and fix my stove? Yeah, I'll take a look at it. Right. You can do some damage in there. Stop doing damage out here. <laughs> so. Nothing. I, I, I was I was driving to the coffee warehouse, and I saw this man being attacked. Agent Cates may not be my favorite person, but I didn't want to hear from Olivia that housekeeping found him on the couch in a coma the next morning. Is that him? Uh, yeah, you stood. Hey. Hi. Um. So can I get you something? No, no, you have given me plenty. It's uh, it's time I finally gave you something in return. Not that I really care what Oh, happened. look, it's mom's did FBI you agent. <laughs> Back so soon? What, did you already get a grease stain on your Egyptian <laughs> cotton? I'll have you know, I scoured all the buildup off the burners and the <laughs> gas jet. I'm just waiting to see if Katrina and Hunter can get the stove going again. I get the sense that you really enjoy being right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Especially when other people have to admit it. Mm. <laughs> you don't think that she actually likes him, do you? Uh, no, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just messing around with her. But still, I, I think we should keep an eye on that guy. So how's the studying going? I haven't looked at it. What's the deal with your FBI buddy? How badly was he hurt when you found him? Pretty bad. Would have been worse if I hadn't found him. And do you think that was random? They didn't take anything. He still had his cash, credit cards, phone, and gun. Where'd you find him? A couple blocks from Corinthos Coffee. So, do you think Sonny's behind it? I don't know. Could have been random. Could have been Sonny. And if he's going to do that to an FBI agent, then imagine what he's going to do to Dex when he finds out that he's becoming a cop. I know you're concerned and you have every right to be, but this is Dex's decision and you're going to have to respect it. Uh, bad news. Oh. Hunter, Katrina, and I tried everything. Either you need a new stove or there's something wrong with the gas. There's no, there's no pilot light. There's no gas. Whatsoever. Oh, all right. Well, I have to try the gas company and call the repair man again. Thank you so much for trying. Yeah, sorry. I couldn't help. Mainly because I'm not going to get the end of it from Jocelyn. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know, you're always my hero. And you'd also be mom's hero if you bought her a new stove. Ooh. Oh. All right. I'm going to call the repairman. Let's see. 